Hello Sagittarius, how are you today guys? So for today, what I got for you is the release card. This is um, the death card, which is Scorpio energy. We have the eight of fire. Um, love messages coming in for you Sagittarius from a Scorpio person more likely. Um, they feel like you are their soulmate and they have a fresh perspective uh, when it comes to this relationship since they're going through some kind of transformation here. And um, you might be busy because this is a fire sign. Things are moving at a fast pace. Um, you're doing many, or, uh, many things happening at once. There's definitely religious factors influencing this relationship or spiritual path. And there's going on that meets the eye. So some kind of a false mask, um, things that the other person is not telling the other person. And let me just shuffle the cards here for you to get the energy flow, um, to get the energy surrounding you, Virgo, just a second. All right, so the current energy here for you, um, Sagittarius, this is a jumper card, is the um, Eight of Wands, similar to this one, the same card. Um, the highest it can be attained here is the Page of Swords. What's underneath is the Justice card. We have the Sun in the past and Five of Wands as the probable outcome here. So the Eight of Wands talks about um, a Scorpio energy here. Still the same uh, cards here. So quite, um, they're sad, they're depressed. And um, they want to send you love messages. Um, they could be waiting for something to manifest in their life here um, to be able to change their perspective. So there's a need for them to change perspective here. Uh, practice compassion. Um, and then for the highest it can be attained, sorry. Okay, we have the Page of Swords. Um, someone is pa spying on you here, uh, Sagittarius. Uh, they definitely want to say hi, how are you? Um, you're just quite busy at work here. You have so many things at hand, um, ha things happening uh, fast for you. And they're thinking of you. They're very much thinking of you here, um, Sag. So what's underneath is the Justice card and the King of Swords. You could be dealing with an air sign, um, Libra, Gemini. And they're thinking this thoroughly, making sure their decision is um, for your best and for their good as well. So they're, they could be an authority. They're very much, uh, they're very mature mentally. And um, they could be a boss or a father or mother figure here. Um, So, yeah, you are divinely guided and uh, make sure to stand your ground and um, defend your beliefs here. Okay, so in the past we have the sun. Um, this is a message of so much positivity, um, so much love, genuine love, um, so much blessings here in the past as well with the uh, sun card everything just turned out great for you when it comes to material financial love passion um yeah it was it's just great so the outcome here is the five of wands and the hangs man um there's going to be a conflict or an argument that will that so you might be um taking action towards this water sign they may because they're not move they're, they're not making any decisions um, you may try to talk to them but they're not budging out from where they're at so they're still going through their dark night of the soul and thank you so much for watching Sag um, hope you get something out of that and I'll talk to you next time guys bye for now